Hey everybody, so I got a new coffee mug. This one is rechargeable and it will last up to four hours keeping your coffee hot. Now keep in mind, this is rechargeable. It's ran off a of battery, so your mileage may vary uh, depending on a lot of different factors. All right, so this does work on an app, so you can use it manually uh, just by pressing the invisible buttons, or you can use the app. Uh, the app is really straightforward, pretty easy to use. You're just gonna look for the, the OT CAX. I, I don't know if that's what it's actually pronounced. And uh, you'll be able to see the temperature that it currently is. It says it's 141 here on the app. Now, this will fluctuate a couple degrees. I usually see from like 138 to 142. This is the temperature that I normally go with, is about 140, but you can scroll it and you can go to 149, which is gonna pop off at about 150 when it's rounding up. Now, I'm not going to go that high. I usually have like about 140 myself, personally. Uh, you could go all the way down as well. So if you want it, well, I mean, you could go as far down as 95 degrees. So if you like yours just lukewarm, that's a possibility. You also have the option of doing Celsius or Fahrenheit, and it will change it on the mug as well. Now, I prefer Fahrenheit since I am US-based, and you will also be able to see your battery percentage. So like right now, we got one bar missing, and I wanna say that this has been going for a little over an hour. Now, it's not at the highest temperature, so it's gonna last just a little bit longer, and the lower temperature you do, of course, it's gonna last a little bit longer. Also, another thing, that, another trick to make these last a little bit longer as well, put hot water in it first, and then brew your coffee. That way the, the wall and everything is already warm and you're not gonna tap into that battery quite yet. Other than that, that's pretty much it for the app. There's not a whole lot to really do there. And it's pretty straightforward, pretty easy mug to use. Also, you could do some of those settings here on the mug itself. So if, like, if you double tap the uh, power button there, it's gonna give you, so if you double tap, it's gonna give you the battery logo. And it's going to give you, well, you got to be a little bit quicker and you can adjust the temperature directly here as well. And it has like a slight click, uh, like, kind of like a haptic touch type thing. That way you can kind of feel it as well. Now the top on this one screws on and off. Right now it's pretty full and this holds 12 ounces. Now this charges up just by using this wireless base here. Uh, just like if you were gonna be charging a cell phone, pretty much. Uh, you can put that on there and you can also charge a cell phone with it. So if we throw a cell phone on the other side, it'll charge. So this is perfect for your desk. I've been using it at my desk for the past week and I love this. Uh, the only thing with me is I wish that the cup was just a little bit bigger because I usually make larger cups of coffee. But if you are wanting something that will keep your coffee at least a little bit warmer, a little bit longer, because you are a little bit slower drinking it, you like to enjoy it a little bit longer, definitely consider one of these heated mugs though. It has surprised me that it that holds the charge pretty well. I did take this to a practice with my girls recently because they, they do sports. And I, I used it for a couple hours. It, it sat there, it was like my spare mug with coffee. And it sat there for a couple hours and it was still perfect temperature. The battery's still uh, over half full. So I can see that it could get the four hours. But like I said, your mileage may vary depending on your ambient temperatures, how you started off. Started off with, like I said, put hot water first. That way the whole insulated walls and everything are nice and warm before you ever put your coffee. That way your battery is nice and full. Or you can even just have it on the base before you leave and just make sure you top off the charge or just have it plugged in pretty much while it's heating up to or staying at the temperature. But anyway, if you are looking for a heated mug, hopefully this gives you a pretty good idea what to expect with this one. I actually really like it. I just want to find one that has a little bit higher capacity. Anyway, thank you for watching.